reading the book's back material made me want to read Calling All Heroes. Multiple adventure fiction heroes like Sherlock Holmes, as well as real-life rebels like the Mau Mau, into a narrative about Mexico 1968's upheaval and social after-effects. Sounded fun. It had the potential to be a disaster, but I figured if it was published, Taibo had probably avoided the disaster. The 118-page novella is actually shorter than that. There are multiple short chapters, letters from the narrator's friends, that make his, this more of an epistolary novel. The letters answer his questions about life shortly after 1968. A viable tactic to develop character, but frankly, that's not really what makes this interesting. The multiple voices, tones, details, and feedback that emerge from the letters were notable. In such short space and time, to create that effect, impressive. There is action. A surreal uprising that has echoes of Borges, Calvino, and Burroughs. Impossible actions and characters doing amazing things, and society changing, if only temporarily, as a result. Tone is often fun. The text tackles, too, problems that radicals face when their revolutions or revolts fail. Not always a happy topic, but it's certainly more common than victories. Important note, Translator did a solid job making this work accessible and engaging. Some fun tones throughout definitely inspired me to seek out more of Tybo's work.